Jeremy here at Local Motors, uh, working on racer production. Uh, some of the things we're, we've been working on is uh, final test fit of the engine in the frame with our Local Motors back half. You can see we've added a <coughs> logo into the rear axle slider plates. Um, working on putting together the coil mount and number plate mount and getting these processes passed down the line so uh, the guys in the back have been helping tremendously with uh, doing all the welding. Um, this bike right here is going to be the Red Racer. Uh, some of the uh, renderings have been put up on Facebook. Uh, you can check our website for some of the different color options. Um, but it's uh, basically going to be Ferrari Red. As you can see here, uh, this is one of our uh, signature pieces on the racer. This is the intake. And if you guys didn't already know, it is actually 3D printed. Um, there's a whole bunch of other videos on how that process is done. But uh, how this will come together is basically a two-part epoxy style glue goes in between the two halves of the intake and I usually drill a couple of extra holes for reinforcement. Uh, this gets pinned together, you'll see there's locating pins on each of the halves and then it eventually gets uh, screwed and glued to the top of this metal ring that gets rolled. It also gets reinforced where the uh, inserts are for the number plate cover that comes on here later that's actually printed. It has a slight dish to it so that makes it kind of unique and gives it that uh, cool number plate uh, number logo. Uh, you can also see we've got our first set of uh, exhaust pipes out of the jigs that we had made earlier so uh, production is starting to gear up.